On November 22, 1963, President John F. Kennedy was assassinated while on a trip in Dallas, Texas. Four emotional days later, he was buried at Arlington National Cemetery with full military honors in a ceremony witnessed by millions around the world. On hand that chilly Monday afternoon to sound taps, the call that marks the end of every military funeral, was a bugler from the United States Army Band, Sergeant Keith Clark. Clark had performed taps countless times, including sounding the call 11 days earlier at Veterans Day ceremonies at Arlington with the president in attendance. Roused at an early hour on the morning of the funeral, he waited on the slope by the Custis Lee Mansion where Kennedy had once said, I could stay here forever. That spot was now to be the final resting place for the nation's 35th president. At the conclusion of the service, following the traditional firing of three volleys, Sergeant Clark raised his bugle and began the call. The song resounded over the heads of all assembled. On the sixth note, his tone briefly cracked. It was like a catch in your voice or a swiftly stifled sob, wrote author William Manchester. Clark stiffened his embouchure and without pause finished the rest of the call flawlessly. Day is done, gone the sun. From the lake, from the hill, from the sky. All is well, safely rest. God is nigh. For 50 years, that one note has lived in the collective memories of Americans who remembered that sad weekend. As one viewer stated in a letter to Clark, in your one sad note, you told the world of our feelings. That one slight imperfection has reached almost folklore status in our country. Like the crack in the Liberty Bell, it remains part of our national heritage. On Saturday, November 16th, 2013, the family of Keith Clark will be joined at Arlington National Cemetery by military and civilian buglers and other specially invited guests for a commemoration of Clark's sounding of taps on that day 50 years ago when America said farewell to John F. Kennedy. Sponsored by the organization Taps for Veterans, the day will include a ceremony at the old amphitheater a massed sounding of taps by over 100 buglers from across the country, wreath ceremonies at the grave of Keith Clark and the Tomb of the Unknowns, and the showing of a special movie about the bugler statue in the Arlington Welcome Center. We hope that you will join us on this special day. The event is free and open to the public. For more information, visit www.tapsforveterans.com. Please be with us at Arlington National Cemetery on November 16th as we observe a bugle call remembered, taps, at the funeral of President John F. Kennedy.